The front line, John Stoward and Nathan Barbala, who got a flyer straight down the middle. Thank you very much. Jaycee Thompson tries to keep him out wide and she's successful in doing so. Don't overdo it, Jaycee. Manages to keep it heading in the right direction. There's a real scrap for position number two. Jared Carno's in there. It's elbows out a little bit with Nathan Barbala. Back then we go to car number 64, and that's John Stowen back in position number four. Gap back to Cherie Barron as they go around the western corner, down the back chute and underneath the pit gates. It's still Josie Thompson to the better of Jared Icarno. Back then we go to Nathan Barbler and catching up very quickly in car 64 would be John Stoward as uh, Nathan Barbler hangs the tail out a little bit that time around the western corner. Washes off the pace a little bit. Akano's up very high on the, towards the fence as well. And uh, that just leaves Josie Thompson in 88. Out and all alone, coming up very quickly on Derek Richards, who's having some engine troubles, I would think, car going very slowly. Also coming up very quickly on Michelle Marbler, who is having some engine problems as well, backfiring out through the exhaust in the western corner. Josie Thompson doing a good job in the 88 car, being chased hardly by Jared Icarno. Got him three wide, Icarno drives straight down the middle as Josie Thompson walked a little bit going past the slower car. And uh, Jared Icarno goes straight into the race lead, into the western corner he's going and starting to move away from Josie Thompson who's now got her hands full with Nathan Barbler. Wanting something better than position number three. Another one down on the journey as they go underneath the control tower. Two laps remaining in the event. And uh, Jared Icarno making every post a winner in the car 21. Good battle. Josie Thompson, Nathan Barbela for position number two. Back then we go to uh, John Stoward who's dropped out of the contention a little bit. White flag, one to go. Jared Icarno, one more lap of the Ian Butcher race parts, King of Roy Speedway. And he's taken out heat number three of the street stocks. Down the back straight he goes and he's opening up a commanding lead. A little bit untidy down the back straight that time. But check it, flag time for Jared Icarno. Josie Thompson in front of Nathan Barbela. John Stoward the next one home in front of Dylan Jarman. Got to go back then to Cherie Barron who is just helping Michelle Barbela across the line. Wow, how about that? I'd have to say a brand new race car and a great win. Excellent, well done Jared Icarno.